Hello again, and this time we're going to look at cleaning our cameras. We've already looked at cleaning tripods and cleaning um, our lenses. Now let's clean the important part, which is the, the, the cameras themselves. There's a link up there to, um, to a previous video on, on cleaning other gear, and there's a link down below in the notes as well. But this time, it's all about cameras. I'm going to show you two cameras. Um, we've got a DSLR here, and we've got a uh, mirrorless, obviously becoming uh, ever more popular. But it's really important to keep the cameras clean. Obviously, we've got two parts of the camera, and effectively, we've got the outside, um, and we've got the inside. And surprisingly, both need cleaning. Now, the outside is quite straightforward. Um, we can, uh, the first thing I use for an outside, I'll take a cloth, actually. Um, I wouldn't normally use this cloth, um, but I just give it a wipe down. Simple as that. You know, it's not, it's not rocket science, but, um, you don't, want to, you don't want to be putting it in the dishwasher. You don't want to be using a scrubbing brush. You don't want to be submersing it in water because cameras tend not to like that. But what you want to do is you want to get yourself a, a paintbrush because paintbrushes are really useful because you can just, you know, sand and grit gets everywhere. And what you want to do is, is, is just have a good brush around all the buttons, all the, all the knobs, all the dials, all the slots and, the, and this and that, just, just to get all the stuff and all the bits and bobs and all the grits off of that camera. Don't forget the back where the buttons are. If you've got one of these articulated lenses, you know, pull that out and give it a bit of a brush underneath. Just make sure you give the camera a really good brush around and just get all those bits of dirt and muck just out of the way. Um, you know, if you've got some sand, sand is a killer. Um, you know, as I said in a previous video, sand is, is very small rocks and you wouldn't take a rock and rub it on your camera but you know we get sand in there all the time and if you get sand in a in a switch or in a dial just in between the the, the actual dial and the camera it can you can you can hear it and feel it grinding and you want to get rid of that and the, and a, and a paintbrush is the perfect tool for that on, on, on any camera it doesn't matter whether we're using a dslr or a mirrorless now that wasn't a good move was it just put my finger on the lens now Cleaning inside of a camera, a little bit more tricky because we don't want to be pressing our fingers and pressing things in there unless we absolutely have to. So let's have a look in, in the inside. Here we go. So in there, we've got, um, we've got our mirror, which is the thing that, that allows the light to come down the lens through the pentaprism and, and up into our viewfinder. And when we take our picture, that mirror flips out the way and allows light to head straight onto the sensor. It's a great idea to clean both the mirror and the sensor. Now, some people are a bit scared of cleaning the sensor themselves. Um, I've, I've done it a number of times. Um, I'm, I'm quite comfortable with it. Um, other people are nervous. And if you're nervous about it, don't do it. Just take your camera down to a, a dealer or a, a cleaning company and they'll do it for you. Um, first thing you need, one of these little... A little blower, everybody's got them in the bags probably. We've all had them for Christmas, but they are highly valuable tools. And you saw me just take this one, I've said this before in a previous video, keep your blower in a plastic bag. Why do we do that? Simple, leave it in, your, in a camera bag, it's gonna slowly depress and open itself up. And as it does that, it's gonna suck anything that's in your camera bag or in a pocket or anything into the bottom of this blower. That's gonna, it's not gonna fill with dust and dirt, but it's gonna have some dust and dirt in it. And then when you, when you blow, chumf, out comes all the dirt into your camera or wherever it's going. So we don't want to do that. Keep it in a bag, nice and simple. Right. We're going to use the blower to clean the inside of the camera. Now it's easy to do. We just tilt the camera forward so it's pointing downwards and blow into it. And it, it is a quite a simple process. What you don't want to do, don't do it like that. Because as you, as you move the dirt around inside the camera, you want it to come out. So get, get your camera facing forward and tilt it. Simple as that. Um, and, and, and that's it for the basic inside of the camera. You don't want to do it on its side. You don't want to do it on your back. You don't want to do it in a dirty environment. You want to be at home really when, you, when you're cleaning inside your camera. But it's just, it's just like that. Nicely tilt it forward and you're blowing the air out. Now, let's show you the same on, uh, on a mirrorless. So I just take this mirrorless here and we'll take the lens off. I'll just put that over there. And we can see the difference on this camera is, I'm just 
there's so just that then just a few bits of you can feel the grit on the top of the desk so there is grit coming out of these cameras although they are, they are clean different sort of mirrorless i'll show you them both next to each other on the dslr we are faced with a mirror and we can see the mirror quite clearly there um, on the mirrorless camera there's no mirror and we look straight at the sensor so a little bit more care required here i mean if you put your finger in there you're going to touch the touch the mirror no great shakes you can clean that off quite easily if you put your finger in there you are going to touch the sensor and you actually don't want to do that but once again to clean the inside of a mirrorless same deal tilt it forward and let it go now cleaning the sensor is a little bit more tricky we're finished with that let's bob that away Boom. i'm not going to use the brush don't use the brush inside your camera you don't want to be rubbing your brush against the sensor um, but we have got i use these ccd swabs sensor cleaning swabs um, you can get them from a many range of stores online at amazon or ebay or, or wherever you're comfortable or as i say if you're not comfortable cleaning your sensor wish your camera down to um, run down to your reseller now what you can do with the dslr um, there'll be a setting on your dslr which allows you to flip the mirror up for, for cleaning and uh, that's quite a straightforward process the, the instructions will be in your manual how to flip the mirror it's always quite straightforward what i'm going to do for the sensor clean i'm going to show you on this um on this mirrorless because the sensor is just a little bit more uh, a little bit more accessible so we've got the sensor we can see it clearly there and we've got this center cleaning swab a lot of people are nervous about this um, i am uh, quite comfortable to do it uh, and you, you take this out of there like that and you this this is quite easy we're just going to take it and run it from left to right and then just back again and then once again on the bottom of the sensor that's it that's all i'm going to do now the temptation now is to put that back in the bag and use it again don't that is guff it's gone you never want to use that again it's you put it in the bin it's finished and it, it took seconds um, some people would, would go at it a little bit more. I just give it a light squidge across and, and it's done. Get your lens back on and that is your that is your camera clean. Now some of those lens cleaning kits have have two swabs. Um, they have a like a wet swab that, that, that puts like an alcohol solution onto the onto the surface and then the, the second swab um, kind of dries it off quite quickly, which is, is a dry swab. Um, I prefer the ones that are just a one swab uh, application and, then, and I don't know what's on them but there is something on them but it evaporates super quick almost as, you, as, as you're going across and it just removes any dirt um, so that's it that is that is a simple way as to how to clean your sensor be very careful when you work inside your camera um, but it is, it is as simple as that Thank you very much for watching this video if you have enjoyed it please leave us some comments down below there's a button just there as well that you can use to, uh, to subscribe to our channel and uh, if you want to watch some more videos try these two because uh, they've uh, they've been picked from our channel that um, hopefully you'll enjoy those um, until next time thank you very much for watching